Today, we're on the hunt for Montreal's sleeping giants. Walking through Montreal, you're bound to come across a lot of street art. From tiny pieces like this one that go way under people's radar, hidden behind buildings, to massive murals that make you feel really small. There's something just about everywhere here. But today, we're looking for something a bit bigger. Spread across the city at this very moment are pieces of art called the Sleeping Giants. And they're called the Sleeping Giants because these things are huge, sometimes as big as the size of a city block. So if these pieces really are that big, where are they? And why have so few people actually seen them? Ella and Peter are a duo from France, and they're the talent behind the Sleeping Giants. They've hidden their art all over the world. The only catch, though, they don't tell anyone where they are. Seriously, there are entire forums of people trying to figure out the locations of some of these pieces. But with a lot of research and a little bit of help, I managed to track down one of these Sleeping Giants to here in Hochelaga. The thing is, I just have to find the place. Now the artists went through a lot of trouble to hide these pieces, so I'm gonna do them a solid and keep it a secret. But I will tell you this, the piece we're going to today is not far off from the Olympic Stadium. All right, so I'm here, at least I think I am. See, I tracked down the sleeping giant to this white building in Hushlaga, but on the surface, it doesn't really look like anything special at all. The only way to know for sure if there is a sleeping giant here is to go to the very top of the roof and check for ourselves. It's time to go high. Higher, higher. There it is. Whoa, that is huge. Oh my God, it's so much bigger than I expected it to be. I never think for a second that something this big was just above me the whole time. Okay, hold up. It looks like there's two more sleeping giants just a couple blocks from here. Let's go. Should be around here somewhere. Not the easiest things to find. And again, it's really hard to make out anything on the rooftops from the ground, but this is the direction we're supposed to be moving in. I think this is it. Should be around here somewhere. Here. Absolutely wild. In case you can't tell, this one measures in at over 6,500 square feet. Ella and Peter are famous for these huge murals, and they've secretly left their mark everywhere from Chile to Norway. So this is a really special view that we're getting. What we do know is the old woman giant and the giant in the red dress were gifts from the artists from their visit to Montreal during the 2016 Under Pressure Graffiti Festival. There really isn't anything else like this in Montreal. Art like this is easy to spot in a city, but art like the Sleeping Giants is a little bit harder. Even though it's hiding in plain sight, you just have to know where to look. All right, that's it for this episode, but I will see you next time with another hidden place in Montreal that you're gonna wanna know about. Take care.